People are looking for ways to cool off this week, but hotter water temperatures can create a breeding ground for a rare microscopic organism. It can pose a risk for people swimming in lakes and other untreated bodies of water. News 10 Bureau Chief Nathan Springfield spoke with one woman who lost a loved one to the amoeba. He explains why people should know about the rare danger. What was supposed to be a fun weekend of swimming here at West Boggs Lake turned into a family saying goodbye to their loved one. He loved going fishing, he loved hunting, he loved being outside, period. And he definitely, he put his kids, you know, number one, he was a good daddy. Waylon Abel lost his life 11 years ago. He contracted primary amoebic meningoencephalitis while swimming with his kids at West Boggs Park. Waylon was doing handstands and things like that in the water and um, Faith said there was a moment where like he complained of having water up his nose and I guess that's whenever the parasite actually entered his body. Primary amoebic meningoencephalitis, or PAM, is known as a brain-eating amoeba. According to the Centers for Disease Control, PAM is a single-celled living organism that is usually found in warm water such as lakes and rivers. While it's extremely rare, it is almost always fatal. Not too long after that weekend trip to the lake, Abel passed away. Now, Hill is doing what she can to raise awareness about primary amoebic meningoencephalitis. I don't want anyone to have to go through what I went through, what my kids went through, you know, his parents, anybody, you know. Hill told me she had reached out to West Boggs Park and several other lakes to see about putting up warning signs like these. West Boggs Park Superintendent Nathan Ream told me on the phone that the park does weekly testing to check bacteria and other levels in its lakes. Ream says all of the tests have passed state requirements. As for the incident involving Abel, Ream declined to comment. Hill said she wants to continue to encourage everyone to be cautious while swimming in the lakes. Life is precious. Don't take anybody for granted. And don't get in that water. If you do get in that water, wear nose bugs. You can read more about primary amoebic meningoencephalitis by visiting our website. It's WTHITV.com. Reporting in Lagodi, Nathan Springfield, News 10.